I'm a teacher, teacher trainer and course book author. So my top tip when I'm selecting a photograph, it's got to do three things. It's got to help students with comprehension, so the image needs to include objects or things that you can use to teach vocabulary. The second thing it's got to do, if it's a good picture, is get students to think critically. So you give them situations where they speculate about the picture or it inspires some kind of discussion. So if they can do those two things, it's a great picture. But it's a brilliant picture if it also encourages students to be creative and having looked and talked about the picture, they then go off and take their own photographs and bring them into class or they make their own videos. So good pictures are about comprehension, critical thinking and creative thinking.